Hi guys, Diana here. Welcome back to a brand new video. So today I'm back to do another movie commentary. So today we will be doing a movie commentary to Avatar, which came out in 2009 when I was 9 years old, y'all. That was like 10 plus years ago. Now I'm 22. The first one was when I was 9 years old. Damn, time really flies. And the second one came out recently in 2022, which is Avatar The Way of Water. And I absolutely love it so, so much. I think it is it is one of my favorite movies. I'm gonna say it. It's one of my favorite movies, y'all. I think I might like the second one better than the first one. And I cannot say why, because there is a huge spoiler in it. You gotta watch it, okay? But... I am a true fan of OG stuff, original stuff, so I'm always a fan of the first one because without the first one, there wouldn't be a second one. So yeah, I'm really excited to just kind of sit down and relive the moment that I felt when I was 9 years old watching Avatar and I remembered falling in love with the characters and how beautiful Pandora was and it's crazy how the first one and the second one is so different because the character develops so well so so well and a lot has changed so i cannot say much about it because i don't want to spoil you guys i'm not that type of person who like to spoil movies okay don't comment me anyway without further ado let's dive on in <laughs> I'm so excited. Sooner or later, though, you always have to wake up. Hey, his brother died. Gosh, I really have not watched this movie in a long time. Because I don't remember anything of this. Can I see, like, the brother's face at least? Maybe it brings some memories. I don't know, maybe I'll remember. He has a twin. Green Pandora? Oh my gosh, I kind of excited to see this. Oh, we know who it is. It's the bad guy. I don't remember his name, but he's the bad guy. I don't remember why they are trying to do, what they are trying to do with Pandora, and then what made Jake kind of these remotely controlled go away from the and army portion mixed with considering they're DNA. up to no good yeah, like why okay. why did you why did they create this avatar and go to pandora like why and then are they trying to take over the pandora and destroy pandora i don't know i don't know i'm, st I'm so confused anyway we're about to find out <laughs> Oh, I remember these kind of sit in there and they transport into the avatar. Oh, I love a character. So, yeah, Grace is like, she knows everything Pandora, let's go. No wonder she was leading, I don't recall. I probably wasn't paying attention when I was watching this movie back then. Unobtainium. Because this little gray rock sells for 20 million a kilo. That's the only reason. It's what pays for the whole party. It's what pays for your science. Oh. Now those, now those savages are threatening our whole operation. I think, right, the Pandora has the thing that he just showed, which is the black rock thing. And like he said, it costs a lot of money. Like, if they can sell it for, like, millions and stuff. So... They want to gain trust of the Pandora people. That's why they built this avatar and to gain their trust. And then destroy the area? Don't. I don't know, man. I think so. So. He loves the avatar because he can't walk when he was a human. Like, this is so fun. 
I just know that when they're acting this, like, there's no avatar. So they're basically reacting to nothing right now. That's insane. That's called method acting, let's go. <laughs> Damn, he is so excited. But can I just say, I would be so scared to, like, lie down and kind of, like, go blank and be like, okay, I'm gonna wake up in a different person's body. Like, this avatar. It's crazy. Like, I, I just can't imagine it. I'll be so scared. Because this is not me, you know. Ooh. Why do I kind of remember this scene? Like, I feel like he's gonna touch one of these and then it's gonna like something's gonna appear hold on uh okay he's gonna touch it and he's gonna shrink and then he find it very interesting he's gonna do to all of it and then at the back of it there's like this creature what is this a rhinosaurus version of don't hammer shark? <laughs> he has that front thing that looks like a hammer shark. Oh wow. That's insane. The audio when he went below water and then got back up. Like, it's as if I'm there. Like, I'm inside the water and then I got out of the water. Like, the audio is like. Damn. This like jellyfish looking thing is like their ancestors, right? If I'm not wrong. Something like that. It's like a sign of like, hey, don't do this or like, you know. <laughs> All I can say is the animation is a bit different than the second one for the characters. I feel like the first one look gonna have to call it guys. I don't know, man. Both of them look beautiful, but they're different. Maybe because it has been years, so the animation kind of like changes a bit, but both is beautiful in different ways. Ooh, I bet it's even scarier at night. At least he's good with the survival thing, because he's like an ex-marine, right? It's weird that he has survival, like, skills. If me, I'll be like, bro, I don't know what I will do. Especially at night, like, gosh, it's scary. <laughs> this part was kind of funny. Because they all just started landing on him. He's like, I want to move. <laughs> What's going on? That character is also hot. What is up with me? <laughs> Jake's hot. He's hot. Yeah, I, I like them. They're avatar creatures. I mean like they are like Pandora creatures, but they are kind of attractive in their own ways. I'm just saying, because they they're great at survival skills, so that's what makes them attractive. Like they can like, you know, protect themselves. That's what that's what attracts me to some people, like when they are good at like self-defense and stuff. <laughs> oh, why do I feel I need to explain to you guys why do I feel like these characters are attractive? It's not wrong. They're just attractive. Some of them. <laughs> Their damn village happens to be resting on the richest. Right. They want this tree thing I think this is where they buried their ancestors like that is why they want to get rid of the Pandora people because like they are living there so like it's like move people oh so Natiri had a sister and she died but Natiri is with the guy that I thought was kind of cute as well <laughs> damn I thought it was his brother so that was supposed to be her mate like what on pending 
Like, uh, we'll be mates, but hold on a second. No, it's not time yet. Oh my god, it just crosses my mind. They created this avatar so that, like, Jake and Grace and those people who are gonna attempt to gain this Pandora people trust. They created this avatar, which means they must have done a lot of investigating of the Pandora people. Like, how am I gonna make the tail? How am I gonna make the hands? The connection of the hair and stuff. They must have killed some Pandora people, you know? That's the messed up side of it. Like, they must have. Make the bond! Make the bond! Put your hair in the thing! Weird way of connection though. I always think that is weird. Unique but weird. Her mate is just like... I feel like he's jealous sometimes. Sometimes he's jealous of Jake. They got a mate, right? And then like... I think the villagers are gonna be so pissed because she mate with Jake instead of the god that she, she's supposed to mate with, I think. I don't know. <laughs> oh, oh gosh. We all made it before Ewa. It is done. Oh, he looks so disappointed. Let's go! He is so jealous, but he's like, I'm not gonna kill you. Okay, I'm not gonna hurt you because I liked you. We were supposed to be a thing. Ha <laughs> ah, ha! Hurry up, couple guys! Let's go! Is that what other thing it is? Oh yes, Jake coming through with the grand entrance, y'all. See, I told you, he's gonna go for the largest Ikron. I guess this is like his way of like gaining their trust. It's like, I'm here, and I'm here with sincerity. And I'm sorry, because of my people, this happened. Even he's impressed. Who? She's free. You're with who? Grace. 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 You're with who, girl? Brother, I'm gonna punch a hole. You follow me through. Oh my gosh, I love that they're like friends now. Bro, brother Shrek. Brother Shrek. Bro, bro code, you know, oh my gosh. Please live, please, please, please. I thought I saw him in the second one. Oh, was that someone who looks like? Please tell me he lives. <laughs> oh, no. I'm getting emotional about him dying and not caring about how Grace died. I mean, maybe because I forgot about like who died and who didn't die. Sute, brother, do you read? Oh, Sute is down. Sute is down. Come on, you copy. Mm. Oh, he's alive. Oh, come on, heal him, people, help him. <laughs> no, no. I thought he didn't die. There must have been someone else in the Avatar, the way of water. I thought it was him. Oh, girl, this was supposed to be a mate. But like, you know, didn't work out. I'm gonna cry for this one. Oh. Hello. Now we're in charge. <laughs> Pandora people are in charge. 
sorry, I can't believe he died. Not him, but... Sute? Is that his name? No, no. What is his name? See? I can't remember his name when he died. And... That's it, man! Oh. Alright guys, so that was Avatar and it is still one of my favorite movies of all time. Hasn't changed. And I totally forget that Neteri's old mate, old bae, died. I thought I saw him in the second movie, Avatar The, the Way of Water. But I guess that was just one of the um, Pandora people that looks like him. And I'm truly sad. I'm very, very sad. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, anyway, I love it so, so much. I can't wait for the other avatars to come out. Knowing that the third one will be coming out in 2024. And then the fourth one in 2026. And then in the fifth one in 2028, if I'm not mistaken. Can you believe it? In those years that is gonna come, like imagine me going to the cinema in 2026 for the fourth one. And I don't know when, what will happen in my life later on. Like, will I have a family? Will I have a kid? That's crazy. That's insane. That is what people like to say, like, it's just a movie, but for me, it's like, some people grew up with these movies, you know, that are created in the cinema, and it just stays with you from your childhood till you grow old. Like, Avatar, I started watching when I was 9, and here I am sitting in front of you guys at the age of 22, watching the second one, that's insane, and then in the future, I'm gonna be watching it with my kids, probably, and my husband, maybe, that's insane maybe in the future i will let my kids watch the first one when and tell them that you know your mom watched this when she was nine because it came out when she was nine it's insane it's mind-blowing people like to say movies are movies but this is one of the reasons why i love movies is because sometimes it becomes your childhood and Avatar is one of the movies that I grew up watching. Even though it's just one movie, it's not like a series or anything, it is still a movie that is part of my childhood. And I fell in love with the Pandora place and how beautiful it is. So yeah, thank you so so much for watching guys and I will definitely look forward to more of the Avatar movies and yeah, more movie commentary. Do comment down below what movie commentary I should do next or any video um, suggestions you would like me to try on this channel. I'm open to suggestions. Thank you so, so much for watching this video and just sticking till the end. So yeah guys, don't forget to ring the notification bell, subscribe to my lovely channel for more content like this and also like this video so that I do know that you guys liked it. So yeah, thank you so so much for watching and don't forget that whoever loves you will love you for whoever you truly are. So that is it guys, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Adios!